Beans. Ako po si Chris Babao. At ako naman si Vincent De Castro. At ako naman si James Fylon. Ang patrol ng Pilipino. Maglilingkod sa inyo saan man sa mundo. Marso 25, isang libot siyang narahan o lukutan. Isang buwan matapos ang isang tahimik na revolusyon, idineklara ng Pangulo ng Pilipinas ang, pro ang Proclamation No. 3 na nagsasabi, By virtue of the power vested in me, by the sovereign mandate of the people, na nagbibigay sa Pangulo na kapatarihan na gumawa ng mga batas hanggat hindi pa nakakapili ng bagong mamukuno sa isang bagong konstitusyon. Proclamation No. 1P1 and Executive Order No. 229, Republic Act No. 6657 at ang 1987 Constitution, ang ulat ni Ronnie Abelgas. Salamat, Ms. Babaw. Proclamation No. 131 and EO No. 229 states that in the exercise of legislative power, which is recognized by the new Constitution under Article X7, 3 section thereof, The President signed on July 22, 1987, or five days before the opening of the new Congress, Proclamation No. 131, Institutioning a Comprehensive Agrarian Reform Program, and Executive Order No. 229, providing the mechanisms needed initially to implement the program. Proclamation of Principles and Policies. The Comprehensive Agrarian Reform Law of 1988 declares that it is the policy of the state to pursue a comprehensive agrarian reform program. The welfare of the landless, farmers, and farm workers will receive the highest consideration to promote social justice and to move the nation towards sound rural development and industrialization. The establishment of owner cultivatorship of economic size farms as the basics of Philippine agriculture. To this end, A more equitable distribution and ownership of land with due regard to the rights of landowners to just compensation for the ecological needs of the nation shall be undertaken to provide farmers and farm workers with opportunity to enhance their dignity and improve the equality of their lives through greater productivity of agricultural lands. The whereas clauses of Proclamation No. 131 stress that the urgent need for a comprehensive, realistic, and flexible agrarian reform program in the light of the present crisis facing our country and the goals of the national economy as mandated by the Constitution. While the 6th to 13th clauses state the requirements of the program and the imperative for the entire Philippine Together with all government agencies, particularly the Congress and private organizations, to support the program in order to implement it. At para sa live coverage ng premiere na pelikulang Enela Biso, nandito po si Vinya Guan. Salamat, Ms. Baba. At ngayon, nandito tayo sa sinema ng Try Mama Malls para sa premiere night ng Enela Biso. At nandito na ang mga cast na sila Derek Ramsey, Bea Alonso, Galing di Bea, galing di Bea, naki! Tapi si Ruby, okay! Oh my God, ang galing di Bea! Box office hit! Ganda, promise, ang ganda, number one! At ako, ang inyong star patroller, Vinya Guanyo, Back to Studio! At iyan po ang mga nakalap na balita sa araw na ito. Ako po si Chris Babaw. At ako naman po si Vincent De Castro. Kami ang Patrol ng Pilipino. At ako naman si James Pelon. Nagrinigod sa inyo sa buong ulo.